Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I just want to give you the shortest possible speech on the doings of Aaron, but before I start, I wanted to say how impressed I and other people have been with the wonderful hospitality of Mexico. Uh, the organization of this conference has been superb, and the choice of hotel has been nothing less than magnificent. So I just want to say from all of us, uh, thank you very much. This has just been a great experience for us. And now, um, the Aaron update. So, uh, IPv4 is being uh, depleted. Um, we're working through the countdown. Uh, we are continuing our message to adopt IVP6, and we are preparing for an increase of uh, v4 transfers. Um, there has been, of late, within Aaron, a, a renewed focus on customer service, trying to get away a bit from the regulatory and into a customer-focused organization. We completed our first Aaron customer satisfaction survey, and uh, we're developing an increased interest in how our clientele looks to us and how they look at us. Um, we are continue the development and integration of web-based functionality, and we continue our participation, active participation, in the variety of internet governance forums. There has been an 18% increase in V4 requests in the past 12 months uh, and over the 12 months prior. Uh, we are finding that V4 requests are becoming increasingly complex. Uh, there's an increasing in number of back and forth exchanges per ticket and increasing um, uh, increase in fraud reports from the community. So we're having to assign more uh, staff and diligence to uh, control and um, address the issue of fraudulent requests. There's more uh, out of region requests as well which also demand further time and effort to verify. In terms of operating improvements, we have new online video training series and additional videos in development. Uh, there's more Aaron on the road uh, training throughout Canada and the United States. Um, we are developing functionality and tools for the, uh, on, based on our, our community. So there's a greater attention or increased attention to the demands of our community for what they want and we're trying to give it back to them. Um, in terms of satisfying our com community, the customer service survey was held, and we are taking action to see that the complaints and issues brought up by our community are being addressed. Um, V4 inventory, it's low and getting lower. Um, we have about approximately 8 slash 16 equivalents in quarantine, returned, revoked, or held space. We have 1 slash 10 for NRPM 4.10 dedicated to V4 block to facilitate V6 deployment. And we have 231 slash 24s for micro allocations. This chart is self explanatory. It shows the uh, increasing use of V6, and the uh, transition is it's on its way. This was. Um, 4,727 total members as of 31st March 2014, and the rise of V6, which is inevitable, we hope. V4 market transfers. Um, there have been 71 transfers completed, and transactions are often arranged through V4 brokers. Inter-regional transfers, 24 have been completed, 2,677 slash 24s. And so far, the only direction of transfer has been from Aaron to APNIC. This is a self explanatory chart on RPKI usage and will be available for further contemplation on the LACNIC and Aaron websites. As usual, we're grinding through policy proposals, and that work continues. The next public policy meeting will be in Baltimore, uh, to which you're all cordially invited, and this will be in the 9th and 10th of October 2014. And there will be a public policy consultation between Aaron and Nanog in Bellevue, Washington, the second, between the 2nd and the 4th of June. And that completes my presentation. Thank you. <laughs>